Hey guys, Boba Ricks here with another video, and this is my third LEGO haul since March, I believe, so that's pretty crazy for me, because normally I would not buy packages, especially from LEGO, because they almost always go for retail, but they've been having some amazing promotions lately, so I had to make another purchase for May the 4th, so without further ado, let's get into this. Now I'm cutting this open, let's see what we have inside of here, if we can get that. Come on, box. Sometimes it's a little hard filming and doing this because I don't want to accidentally do a face reveal when just opening up a Lego haul. So here we have it. Oh, the plastic wrap sticking in the tape. But first off, what we have in here is the May the 4th promotion for the Battle of Hoth 20th Anniversary Edition. This box is actually way nicer than I was expecting. It has a foldable flap where you open it up and then it folds up, so that'll be nice. I'm thinking I'm probably going to keep this sealed, but I had to make a purchase over $75 to get this bad boy because I think it looks pretty great. The only thing is I wish it had had anything, but other than that, the build is spectacular in my opinion. And now for the next set that we have in this haul, we have the Inferno Squad Battle Pack. I hadn't gone this when it came out in January. I know it was in my top 20 wanted maybe it was top 10 or top 20 wanted lego 2019 sets but i love the me figs they look really great and it was on sale for 12 bucks so why not and then the other thing that we got in here is the von major von rex type fighter which i honestly have never seen the resistance show but i really do like the type fighter look i'm a huge red and black fan many of the mocks i build are that theme of color and the TIE Fire being one of my favorite um, Star Wars vehicles, especially the TIE Interceptor. Being in this red and black format, I just had to pick this up and it was on sale for 56. So about average for the price, 70 is really overpriced for this, but for 56, I had to pick it up. Now for the final set in this, this is in a very huge haul, but we have the Praetorian Guard Battle Pack, which is one I've really been weighing. You get some great figures, an uh, extra Stormtrooper, which for a throne figure is not bad. It's a lot better than those um, First Order crew, but just an overall nice set. I love the Mayfigs and the design of all of it. So yeah, that's basically it for this haul. This has been really short. You can see we just have some more styrofoam in the back in the receipt. But yeah, now let's line everything up and see all that we have. So now, here we have everything in this haul. We have the Battle of Hoth 20th Anniversary Edition set, which is very nice. That's the reason I got this whole haul. And then we do have Major Von Regs, TIE Fire, which I love the Ram Black. I'm a huge Ram Black fan, like I mentioned earlier. So it's great to get that, as well as the General Leia figure I was never able to get from the Force Awakens sets. And then we do have the two battle packs with the Praetorian Guard battle pack and the Inferno Squad battle pack. So two great sets there. Everything I bought here I got discounted for the May the 4th sale. And then I got that for free, of course, for the May the 4th promotion. So great haul in my opinion. Not very big like I mentioned at the beginning of the video. But I would say a pretty decent one. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, subscribe, and follow me on Instagram where I upload me figure pictures and other content every once in a while as well. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.